you having fun? No. <laughs> Are you sick of Christmas shopping? Yes. Do you want to go to the seat? I want to jump in it. We lack a bloody Churchill dog nodding off. Mm. Right, get up now. What? We well, ruined it. It's fooled you, we got it from Pound Shop. We'll tell her it's from Pound Shop on Christmas Day. <laughs> That's what I like to see. Oh, Wife we're in have a rinse aid. Wife in kitchen. So we had, a, we had a day off yesterday vlogging and we made this. The most disgusting thing I've ever put into my mouth. <laughs> Hello guys, welcome to a new vlog. We made this on our day off from vlogging yesterday, the orange chicken from Panda Express, which we got from um, Walmart. We had six pieces of chicken each, so Nick decided to put the whole bottle in. And it was absolutely disgusting. I imagine there's about three to four portions in that. It but doesn't actually say on the back how much you're supposed to put It's a in. massive blue bottle. It tasted like makeup remover. Because you put too much in, freaking hell, even I could have realised that. Well then next time you can cook it. Welcome to new vlog, Nick's tidying up. I'm off to do some work. Nick did a VAT return yesterday. Oh, it drained me. It drained me. Well. You can drain yourself a bit more by making breakfast while I'm off to do some new merch logos. Oh, yes, I've got more work to do today. <laughs> I tell you, Summit, I'm good to you, I am. There's your toast with butter. First time in three years. Thank you. I don't think so. Mm. Where's my coffee? It's coming. It's the most wonderful time of the year. Dong, ding, dong, la, 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 la. You got it right. Dong, ding. Dee, 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 dee. Might you be ready soon as it's midday? Yeah, don't you start with me. Excuse me. I've been pressing you for the last hour to get ready. What's happening with these? They're going back to Primark, too big. It says size 9 to 11, and I'm size 10, and they literally flop off. Mm, so, you know what you can do, unless, flop off. Unless I can, like, put a stitch in there, knock them down a size. Just take them back if they're not the right size variants. Well, That's the Primark's big. fault. They're too big. Mm -hmm. Mine's fit perfect. Maybe I'll just put a stitch there, behind the reindeer's ear, and I can, it makes it wider then. If you really want to. Lengthwise, it's fine. Right, come on. We've got to go and get, I know we keep saying it, but one last Christmas present. We have one final Christmas present. And um, what we've been working on in the last couple of days is some new merch designs. So there you go, we've got some new diet starts tomorrow. We've got some new retro lodge guys, uh, Let's Drink the World. Then we've got a Christmas one there. Um, so there you go, and then there's all the um, traditional traditional ones. So that's, they're all available on shop.thelodgeguys.com. Uh, that is shop.thelodgeguys.com. Now, can they we go are to shop available in t shirts and hoodies and bags and mugs and, you know, like nice little Christmas presents, Christmas stockings and things like oh, that. Oh, good idea, that, yeah. Nice yeah, little Christmas presents. If, you've, if you're struggling for, uh, you know, an idea. Stocking colours? Yeah, then go to shop.thelodgeguys.com. The retro hoodie, that one there, that's really nice on a blue hoodie. Well, let's have a look, shall we? This one. one. Yeah. On a blue hoodie. Yeah. There we go. Thelodgeguys.com. It's shop.thelodgeguys.com, so go check it out. Yes. Now let's shop to the garden center.com. And go out. We have one more um, garden, uh, one more Christmas present to get. Right, we're out and about. We're in the car. We're on our way to our last Christmas stop for presents. Although we say that in every vlog, and every vlog we've still got somebody else well, to buy. Thinking of, oh, we haven't got them somewhere. We haven't got them somewhere. We haven't got them somewhere. Well, we've done now. Did you do all the wrapping that you said you were going to do last no. night? Every, including my mum's. Um, no. Most of it. There's one thing I can't say. Um, well, you can't wrap that. Everything, but well, there you go. Then everything is wrapped. Oh, actually, but you can wrap it. I just thought somebody else. Somebody else would need to get some of Oh say my god. <laughs> so basically, we'll be we'll be done on Christmas Eve as usual. I was hoping to get it all done and dusted before we get to the first of we December, will, and then oh, we do we not have will. to think about it at all. It's stress free. Vlogmas without thinking about Christmas presents and oh, wrapping and cards and gift vouchers and all the other crap that we end up buying. Might be able to finish it where we're going today for this uh, person anyway, for both of these people, so right. we'll shall see. So it's quite late on in the day now, it's about 20 to 1 in the afternoon. We've not had any lunch, so we're probably going to have something at this garden centre. Um, and then what we're going to do this afternoon, I want to do something pleasurable because all we've done is work all morning. 
I'll let you decide and I'll do it. Oh yeah, that's how it goes. Until he says, until I say to him, I want to do this, and then he'll go, no, I don't want to do that. Well, you only ever tell me- Brillington what, for a walk around on beach. You only ever tell me what you don't want to do. You don't tell me what you do want to do. Beach, beach walk. I'll go on a beach walk, yeah. Well, and I mean- You're trying to call me bluff? No, I mean just have a little yeah, bump is. down to beach. I don't mean a beach walk, like a, a big beach walk. So one thing that I was going to talk about on yesterday's vlog, but Lee, as usual, interrupted me, is a couple of people have, have messaged and has, asked about when when I do my meditation and how I do it. Now, Lee called meditation sitting there with two fingers like that going, um, blank mind and things like that. I don't do it like that. And Lee keeps saying he's going to try it, but today I'm actually going to get him to try it on this vlog, so we're committed to doing it. But basically, the way I do it, and it's not any of the mumbo jumbo that you usually read in books. You literally lie down, get comfortable, we'll, put your we'll hand, show it. We'll put show your it hand. Get back. Yeah, I'm just going to explain it. Put your hand on your chest, and then you only breathe to the capacity of your rib cage. You don't expand your chest, and you do that for 20 minutes. You cover your face or cover your eyes. Use a flannel or a towel or whatever, or a, I use a cushion, and you basically just breathe. And obviously, you're breathing shallow because you're not expanding your chest. And after about 20 minutes which is the minimum time that you do it, Obviously. you wake up, well you don't wake up because you're not asleep, but you just feel absolutely amazing, as if you've had a full night's sleep. And I, I do it every time, I mean, I do it when I have hangovers and it gets rid of my hangovers. So we're gonna test it later, we're gonna get you to do it and see what you think. Now Charlotte, one of our one of our patrons, she's tried it and she said it's absolutely fantastic. She's actually questioned her yoga instructor why it's so effective and it's all to do with the breathing apparently. So we'll have a go at that later on Here's and we'll see. Here's right, we decided to come into Bridlington after all because we have more of a choice here. So um, we're just going to go and do have some food. Christmas shopping, have food, and um, we need some for tea as well. Oh yeah, not that orange chicken. Oh no. Well, I think you, you, you messed it up by putting the whole tub in. Well, if the instructions were written on it, I might have, I might have followed it, but since it didn't say anything, I just assumed that you put it all in. Shouldn't assume, makes an ass out of you and me. Remover. Disgusting. Nick, come here, I found something for you. In the auction trading company. They do the, wait, they do the old fashioned um, hampers, uh, not hampers, advent calendars. With no that's, chocolates in. That's a fold out one. Look at the size of this. And it's only 199. Yeah, but that's boring, there's no glitter on it. Well, I'm not sure any of them got glitter on it. Look at that. <laughs> Why didn't they get it? Oh, look at that one. Oh, that's got loads of glitter on it and Where it's got Santa it? on it. I want that one. And that one. That's a different one with glitter on. Do you want one as well? No, I've got my Lego one. So I these, one, for, any, one. for any kids watching, um, or any younger people, you've probably never seen these before. They don't have chocolate in them. Or they toys. They chocolate in our day. Um, they just have to have glitter on them and um, nice photos behind each door. One ninety nine. There was, there was, they were eight pound in Smith's the other day, weren't they? Right, lunch break. We're having a ham salad sandwich to share and a nice pot of tea. Oh, you asked for those biscuits, or did they just no, come? Yeah, Very nice. Oh, we've got extra hot water in there. Good, good, good. And um, we've done quite well so far, actually. I can't show you a lot of it, but um, Nick's got his. Um, in fact, I can show you everything, I think. We've managed to get some um, napkins for the Christmas table, um, some crackers for the Christmas table. I'll show you it properly when we get back. Nick's got his advent calendar and uh, now he's noshing on the sandwich. Are you having fun? No. <laughs> Are you sick of Christmas shopping? Yes. Do you want to go to sea? I want to jump in it. Well, I can push you if you like. Just, you know, this is what really, really grinds me about Christmas. Everybody's buying something that they don't want. Everybody's buying you something that you don't want, and everybody feels that they need to do it, but they do it anyway. Rather than just agreeing between you, don't buy something if you don't need it. Just nobody a, listens. Just a couple more shops to go in. Come so on. you just look forward to opening bags of shite on Christmas Day. So we thought we'd have a, a walk on the seaside. I an ice cream. But it's all closed up for the season. So this is what a uh, seaside town looks like in the UK in the winter. Well, it actually looks like this in summer as well, but everything's boarded up and. Yeah, just like summer. And it's, it's like a, a work zone because they're doing it all up for summer. So, uh... <laughs> I don't know why you wanted to pitbull around me yet. Well, I just wanted to have a look around, but it's, I didn't realise it were all closed up. It's just not Disney. No. Not even close. <sighs> We've just run through a blizzard, apart from there's no snow. But it felt like it. My hands. The wind chill like factor. Ice. It's a 16. 
that's rubbish that there's obviously something wrong <laughs> wait until it uh, we get going it's the glasses about, have steamed up it's about one if that the oh, cast yeah. is 16 degree degrees we've literally just run head on into wind i had a bag horizontal with all the christmas presents in that we've managed to finally get lee ran off ahead couldn't hear a word i was saying because of the wind because of the wind and we've just trundled through the car park and literally i can't see now because my glasses are all steamed up you can definitely tell the that winter out, is though. here the sun's out yeah but so is the bleeding wind <sighs> right let's go back to the lodge and get all snug and warm <laughs> right we're back the, the lodge is nice and snug and warm and lee's already run into the bedroom very keen very keen to try the meditation technique that I spoke about earlier in the vlog. Right, so let me tell you what you need to do. Look at you, you look like a bloody, look like you're in a coffin. Right, let me just click focus. There we go, it's focused. Right, cross your hands, overlap them on your chest like you're doing. Put something over your face, usually a cushion, like there, so you can basically breathe, but not, comf not um, smother you even though I'm actually tempted. Um, right, so what you need to do now is breathe, but don't actually make, don't make your, your lungs lift up, do you know what I mean? Just just fill your lungs up to your, up to your rib cage, so your breaths will be like short breaths. You don't have to bother with clearing your mind or any of that crap. Just don't think about things that stress you out, like editing blogs and thumbnails and things like that. And then do that for 20 minutes. Alexa, set an alarm for 20 minutes. 20 minutes, starting now. And then, Keep perfectly still and just do that. And then when Alexa's done in 30 minutes, I'll come back through and we'll see how you've got on. The alarm is going off. Right, let me go and interrupt him. Alexa, stop. Right then. I woke myself up a few times from snoring. You've gone to sleep? <sighs> I think you've missed a point. Mm. Can you feel the nice warm feeling in your hands and your feet? You've kind of ruined it. Well, I, I did it for about 10 minutes and then I just dropped off. Were well, you like a bloody Churchill dog nodding off? Hmm. Right, get up now. Why? Well, you've ruined it. Yeah. It was supposed to be a meditation, not a snooze. Nick, I'm cooking tea! Ow! Your tea's ready! Thanks, honey! Come and get it! Have you got me a gin? No. And my tea's not ready? Because you've, you've drunk alcohol every day this week. What's that? It's your lasagna. Get it down your gullet. Do you ever get yours in a plastic dish? You've had alcohol. Ooh. Yes, I know that needs thrown away. I'll let you two sort that one then. You've had alcohol every day this week. It's about time you had a break. This is not cooked, I can tell. What? Have you have you like stuck a fork in it? Make sure it's not frozen. Well, it says um, microwave oh. for nine minutes. Have I cooked it well? I'm not sure. Enjoy. Oh, how come, I, how come I cook you lovely, delicious meals and I get a ready meal that looks like a... Well, I'm not telling you what it looks like. I'm always busy doing other things, mate. It involves nappies. Mm. What, 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 what? What? What, 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 what do you want? We're going to set the Christmas table up just to test it. See if we need anything else. Okay. <whistles> right, what did we get from these very expensive shops today? Yes, your advent calendar. Keep it still, then we might be able to see calendar. it. Well, so put, kids these days will not recognise that. They'll be like, what the is that? Put that away until um, Vlogtober starts. Vlogmas Vlogtober. starts. <laughs> a bit late for that. So, right, we got, so we've um, got some blue. So the theme is going to be silver and blue this year. I decided that. No, you didn't. So that's our napkins. The most wonderful time of the year. For um, our table. Chargers. I, th I think you need to start with the, the tablecloth, don't you? I'm getting them out of the bag, don't you think? So we got the chargers, because we, we were too short. Have we not got the rest out? They're behind you. Oh. We were too short from last year, so we got them out. 
some more napkins. Right, so the plan will be this year. It had a silver stroke grey oh, yeah. tablecloth. And Nick's going to um, open that now. You may continue. As long as you put it, the plan this year will be that Jackie and Richard are coming, so we're going to get another table and extend this. So it's going to be a big, long Walton-style table. Hopefully, this is long enough. Well, we got an extra one just in case. Well, that's for the other table. Yeah. Oh, it's long. It's long because this is our, our table's extended. So, oh, perfect. Also, we definitely didn't need the other one. Yeah. Perfect. Definitely didn't need the other one. You've got the chairs tucked in. That's what it's doing it for. We're going to get some of them big bowls put back at chair. No, we're bloody well not. Right, charging plates. Now, unfortunately, we had to get different styles because we got some last year. Oh, it's still got Christmas dinner on that one. Yeah, that needs a gouache. So, I had to explain in the shop what a charger plate was for, for the women. Yes, she'd never heard of it. We were in boys and she'd never ever charge a plate. Not that we got it from boys. <laughs> and that's for the, the, other, the table. other table. Right, so that's that. And then we've got some little candelabras, or candelabras, if you want to... Which we had last year. Right. Where's the other one gone? What are you doing? I'm getting candles. What are you doing? Waiting for you to get candles. So, there, and there. Oh, it's like Dracula's table. The napkins are behind you. Napkins. Let's just put one on each plate, because Jackie's dying for a picture, so we're having to do this. I mean, obviously, it doesn't look great, because we're not going to get the, the wine glasses out, and so I well, suppose we could do well, We could do them, just for the photo. And then, I'll do it, I'll do it, pass it here, pass it here, pass it here, pass it here, pass it here. So we've got Tom Smith cheap crackers. crackers. They're only 6 time for a pack of 12, but... 6 6 99 for a pack of 12, but you just... Crack them and then throw, throw it away. Yeah, so. nobody cares about what's in them. No, we want... more than novelty of the crack. My mum and sister used to uh, make their own, actually. No, put them like there so it fills no, out the no, table no, a bit. don't do that. You do, because that's where the, the plate goes. Right, well, you sort them out. Your tit. Have you alternated the colours? No. You sort them out. I'll go get um, cutlery and, and, and things. Are we sorted? Are we sorted? Get in there. Get in there. Moment. Now, obviously, we're going to have some decor on here. We're going to have, like, tinsel, Something bottles, and things like that. But you can't have too much in, because it all just comes back off as soon as you're ready for putting it's the food out. It's not about the eating, it's about the presents. So, that's kind of a rough idea of what our Christmas table is going to look like this Christmas. Excuse me, we're nowhere near finished. Why, what else you got to put on it? Some silver balls, wait a minute. Mm. It looks empty, it's not like enough. Get them Disney baubles! Woo! Position them, not Sam looking at them. Oh, yeah. Whoop. Well positioned. One blue one at either end. We got no coordination. So, this is actually being done on a very tight budget. On a budget. Yeah. So, the, the napkins were a pound. a pound from the pound shop. The table cover was six ninety nine from the Yorkshire Trading Company. The charger plates were a pound each from the pound shop. What's it called? Poundland. 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 Yeah. So that's from Poundland. That's from Poundland. Um, the crackers were six ninety nine from the Yorkshire Trading Company. Um, the candelabras, I think, came from eBay or Amazon. They weren't very much last year. Yeah. Um, so, well, yeah, not on the day. On the day, yeah, to protect the table. There we go. So that's kind of what it's going to look like. So you don't have to spend a fortune to make it look decent. Well, we might have to because there's only six places and there's ten people coming. Well, yeah, but we've got another table coming at some point. So and we'll have another table at the end that looks just like that. Have I'm you got... Doing pretentious photos. See, you can do pretentious photos like this. Send it to people. We're going to send it now to Jackie and Rich to join us for Christmas Day. And they're going to be like, oh! And if we say we've got it all from like Debenhams or... Well, we're not going to tell her that because she might not like it. Marks and Spencers. We'll, we'll tell her Marks and Spencers. She'll be like, oh, how lovely. And then we'll be like, spooled you, we got it from Pound Shop. We'll tell her it's from Pound Shop on Christmas Day. <laughs>
Can we tidy up now for God's sake? No, I'm doing my auntie's shot. Half an hour later, it's still second shots. I've put the lights on now. So we've now got a bottle of Prosecco on, on the table. No Prosecco. Um, and some fairy lights. Yeah, but the fairy lights will be will make those instead of the garland. Yeah, it means we don't have to buy anything else. Yeah. Just needs a lot of nice juicy turkey and food now. Well, Jack is doing the turkey crown and a joint of ham, which will be very nice. And then everybody else is doing the rest. Right, you can tidy up. Okay. Okay, so we've tidied up. I'm just making some new uh, merch designs. You're still doing merch? I bought a, a range of different ones. Check as long out. as you don't try and drag me into the work. Shop.thelodgeguys.com. Shop shop Shop.thelodgeguys.com. Are you sure that's what it is? Shop.thelodgeguys.com. No, you said it wrong again. Right, I'm going to have a gin and tonic. I'm just sat watching the TV, nice and little cosy TV. Never looks as good as it does in real life on the camera. It's really orange. So if you guys have not seen this before, check out our playlist on our YouTube channel. There's one that's called um, Lodge Guys Fireplaces. We have a selection of Christmas ones, crackling fire, jazz music, uh, or just silent ones. We always put them on in the lodge, don't we? Um, can you get me a snack, please? Packet of crisps. Be more adventurous. Uh, cheese on crackers. Okay. You greedy swine. Hurry up, will ya? Oh, you any ass. Don't have hunger over here. There you go. Thank you. And some cheese and crackers and a hot goblin. Where's my drink? drink? Where's my drink? What drink do you want? Just a bit of um. Oh, this is dark. Ugh. Just a bit of um lime and soda. I've got a glass out already in your toaster. Thank you. I'm very busy creating new merch. What are you cooking us up? You greedy swine. What are you Why cooking us up? It's me that's cooking you something up. What are you, you cooking us up? Me, What's in freezer? I'm starving. What are you cooking us up? The Vera's. These were a bit rank last time, weren't they? No, no, no. It was the meat ones that were rank. Eh? We've not had these before. Well, these are veggie burgers. The ones one. we had last time were the steak ones that tasted like plasticine. These are... Ooh. <laughs> they don't feel like Yummy, they actually do look like they do burgers. look quite nice actually. Yeah, I bet they don't taste like the look. Um, uh, are we having flatbreads with them? Have a light burgers? Or do you want them just plain? Mm, go on then. Well, a bit late well, now, isn't it? Come on, make your mind up. There is. Well, you'll have to hurry up and put the flatbreads in. Make your mind up. I want some um, plastic barbecue sauce, that's for certain. Frozen flatbreads. Flatbreads in the toaster. Or... Hurry up. Two minutes. You could have thought that about that before we got them out of the oven. What, what, what? You could have thought that before we got them out of the oven. Well, I left you to do that. So, not been on the slog much tonight. Oh, that's a shame. I bet the subscribers have gone up now. I've um, been to watching another series on Netflix. You shouldn't have got this Netflix. It's rubbish. It's all right, actually. It's very I interesting. I can't understand why you're watching it. It's boring. It's, huh. it's basically like filth. It's called The Last Tsars. It's about the Russian Romanov uh, royal family. Oh. Alexa, stop. Alexa, stop. It's about the Russian of, Russians, uh, Romanov family, and how the Tsars um, and the royal family um, basically ended. It's very interesting. Are they not, do they not exist anymore? No. Mm -hmm. do, do they not exist anymore? What world do you live in? Not Russia. Ugh. Another day is over. Well, you make it sound like you don't like your days. Well, I've got to spend it with you. What do you expect? Ooh, super bright. Right, we're going to finish the vlog now, guys. Goodbye, see you tomorrow. Go to bed. Bye. Yeah, bye. Night. Yeah. Should we just cut it there? No. <laughs> so if you are new to our channel, don't forget to click the subscribe button, guys. Give us the uh, a thumbs up. Click on the notification bell so you get alerts when we have new videos come out. And um, what are we doing tomorrow? I'm going to wrap some presents. Oh, my God. If you mention presents again. I'm presented out after today. Be glad to see, happy to see what you're gonna get me on Christmas Day to open. There's your present. A tea towel. Thanks. We need. We to don't buy. We don't buy each other presents. Not anymore. We had years and years and years of buying each other crap that we didn't actually want, so we decided not. Yeah. To buy My stuff won't crap. Lee's stuff will crap that he was buying me, and I felt like we were missing out, so we said we're not gonna do it anymore. Mm. So, I once, bought him a yellow, I once bought him a yellow polo top and he hated it. Let us know in the comments below if you buy each of the presents, your, your spouse, your partner, your wife, your husband. Um, we did for years, but then we got bored of it. We just, you know. 
I just, we just don't see the point, do it in buying for buying's sake. We like buying everybody else things, you know, the girls, especially. As long as they like them. Well, oh, they will But I hate buying, like, when you go and get the uh, the Link sets and the Nivea hey, sets. With Link sets. Yeah, but if you want the Link set, you go and buy a Link set. You don't have to wait for Christmas for it. I just think it's fun. Let's shut this green shop away. Don't hit my neck. We'll see you tomorrow for a new vlog. Bye.